So let's take a look at what happens when we enable file vault on our devices. So push that policy to enable file vault and I head to my device now. And just before I synchronize this, I want to just check with the device to see that file vault is not enabled. Go to settings and type file vault. Choose that. And you can see that file vault is currently offering me to turn it on. If I choose on, I've got to set my password and stuff. So enter my password and stuff. So I assume it's not on right now. So that's good to see. So we'll head back to Intune and synchronize this device to get that new profile that I've just created pushed out to the device and get this device encrypted. Okay, so that's set now. Let's head back to the device. Give it a few seconds to pull down that profile. Okay, let's see how far we are through this process. Let's see what profiles we've got. We're going to head down to privacy and security down to profiles and see what we've got. So we've got the file vault escrow profile, which came down about uh, nine minutes ago, 10 minutes ago now. And then also we have the file vault profile, which came down just three minutes ago. So that's good. Okay. I wonder if we can see this happening on the Intune side now. Let's synchronize this device once more, but in the meantime, also refresh this page and scroll down to recovery keys and show that recovery key. No file vault recovery keys found on this device just yet. All right, so I just clicked restart because that's what I do with Windows devices. And uh, you can see this popped up to add this user to file vault, enter the password for Dean. So I'm gonna go ahead and enter my password and see what happens. And now it's enabling file vault. I don't really know what happened there. I'm sure one of you Mac experts will explain to me why I needed to start the process of restarting before it enabled file vault or at least prompted me to enable file vault. You can see it's, it's reconnecting the, um, the remote connection here because it's the machine to my right here is off and you might have heard it just reboot there. So we'll give this a few seconds to come back on and then maybe figure out why it did that. There we are. So it is back. We are not yet seeing everything I'm seeing on my screen over here, actually. So give that a few seconds. Okay, so since it rebooted, I've not been able to reconnect via the screen sharing facility on my Mac since the file vault is now enabled. I can assure you the screen says file vault is now enabled. And if I go into, uh, where would I see that? Into hardware and scroll down you can see encrypted is now yes file vault is enabled and if i head down to recovery keys and choose show recovery key you can see i've got a recovery key for the file vault that's now prevented me from remoting into my mac so you win some you lose some see you next time